Hey guys, what's going on? So today, Richie and I are getting ready to go on our little trip. We don't know how long it's gonna be. We're kinda just gonna make it up as we go. Uh, with the restrictions like stuff like that, we're not sure what we're gonna get into, but we're very excited and whatever happens, happens. We're just excited to get out there. But anyway, I wanna show you kinda just what I pack. Um, I'm not packing a lot, but some of you are interested. And um, we don't know how long of a trip this is gonna be, so I'm ready for you know a month, two months, whatever, a week, you know, it doesn't matter, but uh, this is like the basic stuff that I have. All right, toothpaste, deodorant, toothbrush, some different kind of pills, uh, for nails, cutters, um, ear things, um, mask, now it's like one of the things you need. Um, my little waistband, this is kind of handy when you're driving, you don't have a lot of pockets. Um, and then this is like a waterproof thing, this is nice. You can stick some of your electronics in it. I have my uh, uh, plug-in for my computer, um, an extra battery to charge uh, you know, uh, electronics. And that's pretty much it. My GoPro charger. And I just keep them in here just to keep them extra dry. My computer, I need to edit when I go, so I do have my computer with me. And then I have one pair of swimming trunks. Uh, two shirts that are exactly alike. So see, if you see me wearing the same shirt every single day, that's why. These two shirts are exactly the same. And then these are just like lounging, maybe sleeping shorts. That's about it. Um, underwear. And then... The what I'm wearing, these shorts, I'm gonna uh, you know, wear them, wash them every day. And then underwear I got on, and then this long sleeve shirt, it's nice to have when you're driving to keep your arms uh, you know, away from the sun. And then my hat, and that's it. And ear things for my, uh, to edit my videos. So that's it, oh, my drone. Last but not least, my drone. So uh, Richie didn't want to show what she's packing, but I think she has enough. She has uh, definitely more than me. <laughs> <laughs> How you doing, Richie? Ah. Ah. <laughs> All right. So I think we're leaving in a minute. Oh, and and this, my oatmeal. So I do have some oatmeal. Show it's, them my bag. What? Show them, my bag. Show them your bag. She doesn't have that much stuff, but here's her bag. <laughs> so it is a little heavy, but you know, girls usually pack a little bit more than guys. But nice sturdy bag. That's important. And then she has, she does have a little bag too for like daily purposes. And then this bag is kind of cool because uh, you can pack everything in and it's see-through. If you're looking for something, it's very, very easy. And it's kind of waterproof-ish, I guess. You know, so if it starts to rain, it kind of just runs off. So it's kind of nice. It's really easy to find anything. You just shove everything in. And then that's pretty much it. I'll probably end up wearing this. And then, there you go. The problem with this kind of bag is you can't really hide anything. I mean, you know, if you have anything like that. But uh, for me, it's fine. You, get, you kind of know where everything is. He's like, oh, there's that, there's that, there's that. So it's kind of cool. So anyway, that's enough talking for me. I think we're going to go as soon as Richie's ready. Yeah. I think she's been ready for the last three hours. <laughs> I'm just joking. <laughs> yeah, I know she's changing. But I think we're going to show you the terrace before we go. And um, hopefully, you know, we don't know when we're getting back, so um, it could be done by the time we get back. We don't know. We, we have no idea. We have no idea how long we're going to be gone for. Hopefully, the restrictions are pretty good where we can at least travel, travel in Cebu City. We can't go on the other islands because then you have to do like a 15-day quarantine. But we're hopefully sticking in, in the Cebu area. We're going to try to go, you know, all over. So the plan is to see lots of waterfalls. But we'll talk about this later. And we're just going to make it up as we go, so... We're just excited. I'm excited. You excited, Rishi? Yes, very, very. Yes, we're very, very happy to get out of here. I mean, you know, just to start traveling because that's what I really love to do. So I guess enough talking. We're going to get ready and then we'll show you the terrace and then we're going to hit the road. And yeah. then we're going to Moa Boa, all right? Yes. All right. So we'll show you the place when we get there. So we're very, very excited. So we'll see you guys soon. All right, hey guys. So we're just about to leave. Daniel just made his brand new track. <laughs> For his brand new car from the box. <laughs> nice, bro. It looks like a Hummer. <laughs> All right, so we're going to let one last look at the terrace before we go. When we get back, we don't know when we're coming back, so uh, we don't know what it's going to look like by the time we get back. But you can see, you can start to take shape. That's exciting. Wow. Yeah. We're very, very excited for that. 
Let's go up. Let's go up. You want to go up? It's hard. All right, I guess we'll go up. Let's go take a look upside. It's hard. It's hard. <laughs> all right this is where my duyan used to be i'll have to take it down before we go we used to i used to sit right here i think dustin is heavy for this one yeah look at this ladder do you I guys do you, you guys trust this ladder you go there <laughs> go where i didn't know you're you gonna try to go up yeah all right richie's the climber maybe i'll just give her the camera huh you look good for me he and i All right. You, I think that's, you don't need to go all the way up. All right. <laughs> How is it up there? It's nice. All right, I'm not sure if I'm gonna go all yeah, the way up there. Don't go. All right, I'll just hand you the camera. I'll you something you gave This is the top. <laughs> Dustin. Wow. Very cool. All right. Wait. <laughs> I'll go around. All right. Be careful. No, I'm <laughs> Wow. This is the view here. Nice view. Hey guys, so we're just taking a little butt break for me. <laughs> but we're probably like halfway there. Mm -hmm. It's like a two and a half hour drive, it depends. But we just wanted to stop for a second. We came right around this corner and look at this view. That is so cool. Look how blue that water is. It's like growing. Yeah, you can see, like Richie was just saying, uh, where the drop off is. It looks really shallow there. There's actually people walking right down there. And even way in there, but you can see where it gets deep. It's like the drop off is like right there. That's so cool. I wish there was like a quick way to walk down there just to kind of go down there, but it doesn't look like there is. But man, this is awesome. These are kind of the things I've been wait like missing, like yeah. just driving somewhere and seeing something you haven't seen before. So this is a new view for me. We're gonna take some pictures and I'll walk over here for a second. Here's our bike so far, it's not so bad. One back there and one there. So we're traveling pretty nicely so far. It's not so hot. Once you're going, the long sleeve uh, helps a little bit. How your how your shorts? Yeah, sometimes. Yeah, sometimes my legs start to catch on fire if you're in the sun for too long. But here's one more look. We're probably just gonna get driving here pretty soon. This is really a beautiful spot. You can see. It's so shallow. It's like people just walking so far. There's some people swimming out there where the drop off is. You can see clearly where the drop off is. That's so cool. It's like, it looks like it's probably like three feet deep. And as soon as you walk just like two more feet, it's probably like, you know, who knows, 10 feet maybe. All right, we just want to show you this cool view. But we'll probably continue on. Probably another hour and a half to go. And then we'll be there. See ya. All right, see you guys later. All right, hey guys. So we just got here. It just started. It just stopped raining. It started raining and weird. It came out of nowhere. It was like sunny. You know how it's sunny and it rains. Mm. That's kind of how it was. But we just got here. Everything's so good so far. We we'll do a little 360. We got some like little cabin styles in the background. And this is kind of where we can cook if you want to. And then it's really nice. It has some nice trees. Then our room is this way. What do you think that is for your clothes? Okay. I thought it was some kind of like TV antenna. <laughs> and there's like our mini bathrooms, kitchen area. Very cool. Yeah. And then down this way, we are room number eight. And there's actually another, there's like pool tables up there, billard. And there's actually a pool you can swim in too, which we might go to later. But here's our room. We really didn't even look inside yet, so this is uh, our first time walking around. So this is, we'll walk with you in here. So here's our room. We got a fridge, cool TV, 
You, me. Nice. Ooh, that looks nice. What do you think that is? Do you think that's Philippines somewhere? I don't know. That looks nice. Look how blue. Wow. So this is cool. Can I see <laughs> yeah, Richie's, Richie's already planning her spot to do TikTok. This is awesome. Man. Nice little place to relax. It's awesome, man. <laughs> it's awesome, man. Just in case we want to sneak out the window, we got a ladder. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we do have our own bathroom. We weren't sure if we had our own bathroom or not because uh, we saw all the ones outside. So cool. It's always convenient having your own bathroom. All right, so that's a little look. Very exciting. So this is our first day here. Yes. And um, just for those that are interested in these type of things, so this room I think was like a thousand pesos a night. Mm -hmm. So that's a pretty good deal, especially when you're traveling with someone. When you're by yourself, you to be cheaper, you might want to go to like a hostel mm -hmm. or something like that. It could be around like five hundred pesos. But with your with you with two people, you might as well upgrade to another, mm -hmm. another room. So it's like the same price for one or two people. So, um, so this is what you get for around a thousand pesos. I think it's pretty cool because you get the, um, the pool tables are free. Yes. And then the pool that you get to swim in is free. Yes. So that's pretty cool. And so we'll you can get to do that later. Free billiards. Yeah. We call that pool. Oh, pool. Yeah. It's weird because it's like it's pool, cool. swimming in the pool. But yeah. billiard, what, what do you call here? Billiard? I only, I, for me, I know billiards only. Yeah, we call it there too, but we call it pool as well. Where you guys are from, where you, do you call it pool, billiards? There's probably other names you can call it too. But I'm not very good, but we'll probably play a little bit later. But for now, I, got, I don't know, we just wanted to show you this. We'll probably rest for a minute. Yes. Unpack a little bit. Um, and later we'll go get the... Yeah, that's one thing, another thing we have to do. Um, for those that are interested in traveling right now because of the restrictions, we went through a couple checkpoints, but we never got stopped. It's mm -hmm. usually people, they stop the buses. Buses. Usually stopping buses to make sure uh, they, don't, they aren't overcrowded. Mm -hmm. So usually they stop those, make sure there's not too many people on there, mm -hmm. and then they let them go again. We don't know too much about that, but we know what we went through, and so far we didn't get stopped. Yeah. But it's nice having your license, having your registration, have everything checked. So this is like the time, if, before you take a trip, make sure you have all that taken care of before you go. But it's, it's a good feeling now. It's funny because since I got my new license, mm -hmm. I never got stopped one time. <laughs> but ever, waiting. Yeah, I, I kind of want to get stopped just like, hey, here's yeah. my Philippines license. You know. <laughs> yeah. uh, but that's that. Um, I, don't think, I think I was going to say something else. Yeah, the checkpoints and were pretty much We through. need to get that sleep. Yeah, good thing we talked to, uh, what is it, Poi Poi? I think oh, it was Poi Poi, yeah. yeah. Good thing we talked to him because he said, um, the only place that you need to get a special permission is the White Sand Beach. Yes. And we do plan on going there. And that's in this general area. Mm. But he said Kawasan Falls that we probably will do. Yeah. Some other waterfalls, they're in different areas, so he doesn't think we need anything mm. for that. But for the White Sand Beach, uh, you need a special thing mm. to go there. Which doesn't sound or at like... least around here, he said. Okay. Mm. So it doesn't sound very hard to get. So we might as well get that just to have it. And then we have that just for this area. And then we, I guess when we go to the new area, we'll figure out as we go. But yeah. very exciting. So yeah. right now we're just going to rest and then we'll see you we'll, the yeah. next place we go. We have yeah. no idea where we're going, but we'll see you later. Right here now. <laughs> yes, very excited. <laughs> <laughs> uh, hey guys. So uh, Richie said I need to get some tan, some color on my yeah, so chest I'm not because alone. Yeah, I was laying down and I disappeared in the white sand. We're at the white sand beach right now, by the way. Yeah. Uh, I'll turn around in a second, but it is it's absolutely beautiful. beautiful. Yeah, and the difference. Oh, uh, we were just talking, we just had a little meal, and they said like uh, a week ago or something, or yeah, there, we, there are many, many people here, but now because of the lockdown, yes. like nobody's here, so yes. we pretty much have this whole place to the so ourselves, look at this, like no one's around, this is awesome, and actually we were here many years ago, and I, like when I first met Raymond and the family, mm -hmm. and anyway, it was like night and day, like before, it was, there was so many people here, and it was just like crowded. so crowded, so this is nice, this is a nice All little refreshing yeah so I guess we're gonna walk in I want to we're kind of scared we're like in this little shade here my white body up you probably see me disappear so I'm just walking around just a hat with my head yeah <laughs> really though if I lay down I think I'll disappear in this white sand but I don't know it, it is hot it is warm but it does feel good but here we go there's a nice empty bottle there someone had a good time <laughs> I will have you're not gonna put those on yeah, and it's nice because of this beach I already actually went in and uh, there's no hard rock, so if you don't want to wear those, you don't have to. It's nice, very nice beach. Wow. It's Look how blue this is. It's sparkling. 
This is really beautiful. And that's still Negros over there, right? Yeah. That's probably like Dumaguete, maybe. Wow. I have no idea. I, wow. I'm not sure exactly where we are. Oh my God. <laughs> it's deep. Ooh, it, gets, it gets deep quick, but it feels nice. Oh. So here's kind of the surroundings. They got like high mountains in the background. That's so cool. You can uh, really see that. Wow. I mean, with no clouds there, you can you really can make it out. You can see the water sparkling. Yeah. If you can't tell how blue this is and how clear, like you can see my toes. And you can see it gets darker out there. There's a big drop off. I forgot to bring my uh, goggles. That's one thing I forgot to bring. Um, I brought them with me from America to here for events like this and you know, we just forgot. But it would be kind of nice to have the goggles right now. What do you think? What do you have to say? It's very good. <laughs> it is very good. It's been a long time since we got to swim like this. This is cool. So I'm probably going to put the camera away. I don't want to get this wet. Once I get this wet, then you can't. It's like muffled, the muffled sound. And I'm eventually fly the drone. So I think I'm probably going to shut this off and you see the drone right away because that's what we're going to do next. So any last words? I love you all. Yes, we love you guys. We're really enjoying ourselves. This is awesome. She's leaving me hanging. <laughs> hey! <laughs> all right, they say hey too. So I'm going to put the camera away and then we're going to swim for a little bit and then you'll probably see the drone next. Yes. So we'll see you guys later. All right, hey guys, uh, before we talk to them, I just want to show you the sunset. Look at that. This is like the perfect time of day. You could sting out here and it's not too hot. It's not too cool. It's like perfect. But anyway, Rich and I just had pretty much a perfect evening. We had some food here. We stayed out here. We swam. We relaxed. It was like a perfect day. And meet hardworking people. Yes, we did. We, um, they were selling Balut and they've been walking past kind of like, you know, just back and forth selling and selling and we you know we just weren't hungry but we noticed that they were working hard and then they came over here and tried to sell us and we didn't want anything but um, maybe we can kind of get to know them a little bit. Yeah. And how old are both of you? How old are both of you? 12 years old. 12? 8 years old. So you, how long 
how long do you usually work for a day? Bila mo kaoras magtrabaho, alas four and and ten hours. Four, four p.m. to ten p.m. Four p.m. to ten p.m. All right. And around like four and five o'clock, it's really warm. Right now, six hours. Right now, it's like a good temperature. But before, it was really, really hot. Before, um, on average, how much do you usually make a day? Pila sa imahali ninyo kasagaran na isa sa kadlaw. Sometimes one fifty, sometimes three fifty, like that. I have commission fifty five, sometimes twenty five, like that. So how much do you? Uh, how much is one balut? Twenty-five. Twenty-five, and how much do you make if you sell one? Five pesos. Five pesos. Okay. For one egg. Okay. All right. <laughs> it's hard to say no. They're trying to sell to us. We're like, we're not hungry, but yeah. uh, you know, we'll talk to them for a minute. Just kind of, I, I really, just think it's cool how young people yeah. are working hard. To, and you know, just she to said get. She said she doesn't have parents. She just lived at her lolo. Really? So how do you get here each day? Tricycle. Tricycle, all by yourselves. Uh, three of them. And I think they said sometimes they take their tricycle and sometimes they take a boat. Oh, yes. They said tricycle, 50 pesos, and for boat is 100. 100, okay. So sometimes, well, which one's faster? I say the boat. Boat is faster. So the boat, you don't see it right now, but uh, you'll see like little motorboats going by. So you guys live somewhere over there? Yeah. And you sometimes you take a boat and sometimes you take a tricycle. All right. So, um, I don't know. We're just kind of, we're about to leave and they came and wanted to sell something. We weren't hungry, but we do want to give them a little reward for their hard work. Um, we don't have any presents to give, but if, um, how, how much to buy it all? Like, it's for 750. 750? Yeah. Banana, not balot, pinoy. Pinoy? Yes. Together. So, so they're selling balot and pinoy. Balot and pinoy. Okay. So they, Sell all of it at 750. How much did you sell today? They sold one today. They started 4 p.m. So. Okay. Well, you guys get to go home early tonight, okay? Here's 500 each for you guys. 500 for you and 500 for you. You're very well. Oh, no, it's okay. It's okay. I don't need to thank you. But just promise to go treat you guys something nice. Like buy yourself something nice or have a little fun. Go home, buy a snack, maybe some can I, ice can cream. Can bring one at the... Of course, yes. yes. <laughs> yeah, you can show us the routine. So how, how do you start? when people want to buy something, you can kind of show the uh, transaction. Oh, you're very welcome. You don't need to say thank you. It's okay. Okay, here. So you have both balut, and what's the difference between balut and panoy? Okay, um, uh, balut with chicken or with duck, and then panoy. So the, is the one with the X, panoy, because has the X. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And if it has balut, yeah. it has the number on it because that's how many days old, right? It is. The panoy so, is 16, 17, 18. What do you want? 16. 16. <laughs> so how old is this? Since this is, uh, ooh, that's really hot. <laughs> yeah, it's really hot. <laughs> yeah. So how old, how old is that? Since it's a Panoy. 15. 15 days? Yeah, 15 oh. days. Okay, so it's one less than yeah. the Balut. Yeah, it's really, really <laughs> hot. So how do you guys keep them warm all night long when you're working? Just keep, so you just wrap them in. That's oh, newspaper. Yeah. And then you have this like cooler to keep Here. it warm. Look. Wow, that's many, many. No, yeah. All right. It's a pinoy. So Richie. We have spicy. So yeah, what well, do you have here? This I is. Want spicy. It looks like some kind of chili and peppers. And, and I'm guessing vinegar. Is this hand wash? Yeah. Oh, well, they even have half wash. Ah. And then this is uh, looks like salt. And I'll then eat this both on the here. same. All right, Richie Ooh. can show us how it's done. <laughs> Ooh, it's okay. So those are both pinoy. Yes. All right. Pinoy ni poro. And are those kind of like the hard? Are they like the hard boiled eggs or? Oh, it's like the. It's more similar to that? One pino and one balut. So look, okay. okay. In it, so I'll just put in plastic. Okay. Give me two. <laughs> okay. No problem. And you guys can do whatever you want with the rest. Do you guys want to eat them, give them away for free, or you guys can sell them too? Yeah, just sell them again. Whatever you guys want to do. If you don't sell all of these tonight, what do you do with the rest? Opanitan, dili mahalin tanan. Usaman niyo yung sobra. 
put back. Put back, and you sell and them the next day? You, you have to cut the thing. The, uh, the, the, money. Oh, the money you give me, I want to buy rice. You'll buy rice? Yeah. Alright. Good. And, and you live with your Lolo and Lola? Yeah. Okay. Very responsible kids. Eh? I totally get something for a treat and they're going to get rice. Okay. I want all balloons. All balloons. No problem. You want one? Maybe one for later. Make it three. Put it all on and die. They are little snacks for later. Good yeah. snacks for later. All on and die. Uh oh. So right now you're preparing the little bag that you can take home oh, with okay. you little bit of vinegar and the pepper, or not the pepper, but the salt. Mm. It's so hot. Yeah. Who prepared, like who makes these? The, the, uh, the uncle. Your, your uncle, okay. And are you siblings? No. Cousins? Cousin. Cousins, okay. Yeah. So your uncle makes them and then you come out here and sell them. Yeah. All right. So how much does your uncle get? Twenty. We have five pesos. So they they get twenty and you get five, yeah. and you come out here and sell them. Yes. What do you think the harder job is to cook them or to sell them? Sell. To sell? You need to talk to your uncle. <laughs> Renegotiate. In it, Oh, it's okay. Thank you. It's All so right. Thank you so much. <laughs> yeah. Thank you so much. You're very welcome. All blessings. Thank you. <laughs> Do you hear these kids? They're very, very polite. Hi. So they said like they're very, <laughs> they're very likable kids. Thank you so kids. much. <laughs> like and subscribe. Wow. Yeah. Wow. You, yeah, you guys can't, so you guys can't, can't, can't you say, say no, no to that. that. So they said they're going to go home and get rice with their money. So mm -hmm. you guys can go get rice with that. But here's 500 more for you guys. <gasps> To go get, yes! you guys promise to get something fun? Yes, yes, okay, okay, yes, promise yes, to do something yes. fun with that. The other one, you guys can buy rice, but and for that one, do something fun, okay? Yeah. You promise? I promise. Promise, all right. <laughs> so you guys have a safe night home. Are you guys walking, or take, are you guys taking the boat, or taking? No, tricycle. Tricycle, okay. Yes. Hopefully that can go towards the tricycle, too. Yes. So, all right, it was really good meeting them. Hopefully yes. this motivates some young people, wherever you're from, to work hard. Yes. What, what are you guys' goals for the future? Like, what do you want to be when you grow up? Nurse. Nurse. We need many, many nurses. We need to help people. That is a good attitude to have. Nurse. <laughs> nurse. Two nurses here. So we have two future nurses here. We need here. to help my grandfather, grandmother, like that people. Very, very good attitude. Smart girls here. So hopefully you guys stay to school, get good grades. Yeah. Study listen. first and job like that. Yeah. Listen yeah. to your elders, your yeah. grandparents. Lolo. Yes. Yeah. Especially only your Lolo is taking care of you now. Yeah. yeah, and then when you're older, you can take care of them. So it's kind of yeah. like a trade-off. Yeah. That's yeah. that's very cool. All right, so we're gonna let them go now. You guys get the day off, right? Are you guys gonna go yeah. home now? Yeah. All right, go they home. They're happy and I'm happy. <laughs> Every, I'm happy. Everyone's you need gonna to go home happy. Subscribe and like <laughs> and follow. <laughs> she needs her own YouTube channel. She's yeah. better than me. <laughs> but it was really nice meeting you guys. Hopefully, you guys uh, get to do something fun with that money and uh, enjoy the rest of your night. Okay. Tell your Lola and Lola. We yeah, say hello, okay? Okay. Okay. All right. and Richie. Okay, Richie. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I guess we'll say our goodbyes tonight. Yeah. So okay. we're probably just going to... Did you want to say something? Okay, bye. <laughs> bye. All right, you guys we, have a great night. Yeah, we, we might meet them again because... Yeah, we, tomorrow we again. <laughs> yeah, this, this is the White Beach if anybody's yeah. interested in coming it's here. It's a really, It's a really good area. Um, Here's the H key. Mm. The H, what's the H key? Name here, H key. Okay, so they have the different names? Yeah. yeah. There is a bastaco. Here is each key. There is corals. Oh, wow. Ah, there. So the corals, like you get, the, like, uh, coral reef? Yeah. Yeah. Reef. Can you see it? All right. So there's different it's names. It's so far there. So I think down that way is where you swim to see the turtles and the yeah, sardines yeah, yeah. and the corals. Yeah. And there's a different island there. Do you know yeah. the name of that one? Pescador. 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 All right. Yeah. So that's where you can go snorkeling, maybe? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Sardines, turtles. Dolphin and whale shark. Whale shark. Wow. Yeah. Oh, very I see cool. whale shark. It's so big. Really? Yeah. Some of those you gotta be careful because yeah. if they yawn, you'll you're go right <laughs> yeah. in their mouth. The water is. <laughs>
Like that. Really? Yeah, I want to see like that. Sometimes in Panasama, whale shark can go over there. Okay, yeah. so that's where all the whale sharks congregate and they yeah. hang out and have business meetings. What's your name again? <laughs> Lara Jane. Lara Jane? Crazy. I'm a 12 Crazy. years old. Wow. When's I'm your... from Panagsama. <laughs> wow. <laughs> When's your birthdays? Are they coming up? April 5. April 5? Okay, that wow. was not too long ago. She forgot her birthday. Oh, <laughs> that's something to, good to remember. Go back home and ask, ask, your, your, mama. ask yeah. your mama when your birthday is. She doesn't have mama anymore. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Just only grandmother. And ah, so you're uncle. both. You're living with your yeah. dad, no? Ika living with your mother and parents. father. Mm. So, because we are friends. That's all. It's good. Stay friends. It's nice to have a good yeah. friend you can trust and yeah. workmates or workmates. Mm. Do you guys live together? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Great. Well, that's cool. It's nice to have a working partner that you can trust and yeah. go back and forth. It's nice yeah. to have partners when you're working, especially so young. But, uh, it's delicious balut. Do you want to buy? <laughs> yes, check out their balut. Yeah, um, check out. <laughs> How if can you, you say? To, if you want to come here in Mualbua, find them and eat balut. Yeah, it's delicious. I yes. bet you guys sell out every night. Yeah. How, can, how can you possibly say no when they try to sell like that? That's, yeah. that's, you guys are pretty good sellers. <laughs> I like their charm. Where did you learn to sell? In my, grandpa, in my grandfather, she said, you, you need to sell because we didn't have money anymore. Yeah. But like, who taught you how to do it? I think you're just naturally natural, sellers. I think yeah. you're just natural born how to sell. So that's amazing. Yeah, you have, because yeah. Because we need help my family. Wow, that's amazing. Very good for you, good for you. So stay in school, get good grades, listen to your elders. Yeah. I don't know what other kind of advice to give. Just uh, keep working hard and okay. going for your, okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Do you have talent? No. You said you TikTok you then. Ah, yeah. Oh, really? TikTok. Uh, it seems like everyone yeah. loves TikTok here. TikTok, and I'm a singer and dancer. Singer. Ooh. Do you want to give us a song sample? It's just a little bit. I don't remember. All right. Just one day. One day. Under the moon, that I see is a reason. Under the sea, it the away. You just like that. That's oh. good. Wow. <laughs> I like that. that. That's a really good song. I like your lyrics too. Thank you. <laughs> All right, so we'll let them go. They sold everything, so now they get to go home. But before they go home, if you don't want to do it today, but very soon, buy something for yourselves. Yeah, they said, um, um, since they just came, they will sell a little bit, but they will go home earlier than 10. Okay, good. So as long as you need to go home and take a little break, yeah. and then uh, hopefully yeah, buy something. Yeah. <laughs> We need to love yourself. Yeah, I told them to uh, buy, some buy food. Yourself okay. Eat. Yeah, food. We try to get something fun. Yeah. But it's your choice. It's your choice. If they if they want to get more food, I can't yeah. I can't stop them from doing that. Whatever makes yeah. you happy. So, you guys can go whatever puts a smile on your face. I am happy. All right. <laughs> it's, <laughs> yeah. It's so funny. Here's the future, guys. This, I think we have a promising future. These yeah. two two young ladies are hard workers and be nurses TikTok? one day. TikTok? Yeah, uh, my auntie have TikTok. I'm Jolene, 18 years old. That's yours? No, my auntie. I think it's, you? it's probably we best just to tell your auntie. Ah, okay, yeah, yeah, we don't we don't want to give. Yes. Okay, yes, <laughs> follow their auntie. <laughs> All right, see you again. See you All right, again. bye guys. So we're just gonna say goodbye, and we're not goodbye. sure what our plan is tomorrow. We might what? go see some sardines. Yeah, sardines and turtle. Yeah, we might go do that Subscribe tomorrow. Subscribe and like. Don't <laughs> forget. Don't, don't, don't forget. Don't forget, guys. <laughs> so you guys, God bless. Take care, and I think we're going to head back now. So it's yes. nice meeting them, and okay. we'll see you guys later. Yeah. So bye-bye. Yeah, bye-bye. <laughs> yeah. <laughs>